Hello everyone. Welcome back guys. Today we are going through uh, Cambridge Lower Secondary Progression Test of Year 8. This is paper 2. Uh, you can use calculator in that. So let me start with question number 1. X is an integer such that X is less than 8. So integers are the numbers on the number line. So any number less than 8 may be 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 0 and also the negative numbers negative 1, negative 2. So you can write any of these two numbers here. Let's say I'm writing here 0 and let's say it's 3 whatever number uh, any number less than 8 is possible to write here. Now write down the order of rotational symmetry of regular hexagon. Hexagon is a shape like this having six sides. So there will be six line of symmetry. So you see like this one, the six sides. So we can have six line of symmetries here. So one will go from in the middle like this here in the middle of the sides. So there will be six line of symmetry, right? Sorry, sorry, not line of symmetry. These are rotational symmetry. This will also be a uh, six because their six sides are equal. So there will be line, uh, six rotational symmetry. Six times you are going to get the same shape when you rotate up to 360. And draw a ring around a letter that is uh, the subject of the formula. So you see here, subject of the formula is u because u equals to something. So we are going to put ring around u right so now next number four is a bag contains uh, counters that are red or green or blue a counter is picked at random the probability of picking each color are shown in the table find the probability of not picking blue color so blue colors probability is 0 0.65 so not blue probability of not blue is 1 minus 0 0.65 so this is 0 0.35 so final answer is 0 0.35 right question number five uh, put a tick next to each of the correct statements about quadrilaterals uh, now in quadrilateral all squares are rectangles so uh, squares and rectangles so this is square and this is rectangle so meaning to say all the properties that satisfy this square also satisfy the rectangle so this is a correct statement all rhombus are squares so rhombus cannot be a square because in rhombus angles are not 90 or parallelogram are rhombuses and so all cannot be because rhombus have all the sides equal but parallelogram not all rectangles are parallelogram so this is correct because all rectangles have uh, what's the definition of uh, parallelogram that is opposite sides are parallel and equal and uh, opposite sides are parallel and equal right so that is same in rectangle also that's so that's why this is correct now uh, number six jamia and Yuri both correctly work out the answer to uh, this 4 3 by 8 plus 2 3 by 5 without a calculator here is their working you see Jamila she has break up these fractions into mixed ones and Yuri what she has done she has collected the whole part separately and uh, the fraction separately now the question is Yuri's method has fewer steps right here she has fewer steps than Jamila's method uh, give another advantage of using Yuri's method rather than Jamila why this method it can be preferred Yuri's method so you see because she has separated the whole part so it's easy to do the calculation so we can write down this here the whole numbers have been kept the whole numbers are kept separate yeah. 
to make the calculation easier. Right. Question number seven. Uh, a total of total cost of hiring a bike is worked out like this a fixed cost of 35 and an additional charge of 20 each day and so 35 is fixed write the formula of cost c so we need to write down c is equal to what to hire a bike for d days so we are given d days so 35 is fixed right 35 is definitely they are going to charge then additional of charge of 20 each day each day is 20 times d because there are d days so that will be 20 d so this is going to be final answer 35 plus 20 d uh, number eight <coughs> and the function y equals to uh, 2x minus 4 can be represented by this calculation uh, this function machine so you have input value here input then output so what goes in here uh, complete this function machine complete the table so this is the second part so here you see input is x then x is multiplied by 2 so you can write here times 2 and then subtracted 4 so minus 4 that gives you the output right now complete the table for the function y equals to 2x minus 4 so when x is this is x and this is y so we have y equals to 2x minus 4 now x is negative 3.5 minus 4 so you multiply this one first this is negative 7.5 minus 4 so that is going to be sorry this is 7.0 so both are negative so we can add this it will be 11 negative 11 now here this is the calculation for this now for this one the second part we have uh, given y now y is equal to 2x minus 4 y is 11 so we are looking for the value of x so shift x to other side so 11 plus 4 this is 2x so this is 15 equals 2x over 2 over 2 so this is 7.5 so x is 7.5 right now number 9 complete these sentences so uh, 792,344 correct to 3 significant figure 3 significant figure is here so this number is less than 5 so you are going to make this 0 so that will be 792000 right now this corrected to two significant figure two significant figure are here so as you see this is 5 so we are going to add if 5 or more you add one here so this will become 0 0.40 so now one thing that you guys need to be careful don't write it it cannot be uh, 0.4 you can't write this 0.4 this is wrong um, because it will give you one significant figure and we need two significant figures so that's why you must write 0.40 now number 10a ahmed has a box containing 154 pencils that are yellow green or blue the ratio of yellow green to blue pencil is this uh, so we have yellow green and blue to ratio 5 ratio 7 right so work out the number of number of green pencils in the box right so green is here so they are 5 number of green pencils number of green pencils is equal to 5 over out of how many so total is total of the ratios is 2 plus 5 plus 7 this is 14 so 5 out of 14 and we have total 154 so when you divide 14 14 11 times 5 it's 55 right now part b Ahmed has two boxes of pens both boxes contain red and black pens only 
uh, the table shows gives some information about the color so ratio of red to black proportion of red pens so this is two and um, this is ratio and this is proportion proportion is always out of total out of total right so uh, proportion of red red is this one is red and this one is black so it's two out of totally 7 plus 2 is 9 right now like here likewise we have red pen 3 over 10 so that means the total number of pens is 10 so 10 minus 3 that is 7 so this is red is 7 ratio sorry 3 ratio 7 so this is 3 ratio 7 right so that's how you can complete this work so let's move to next question i hope you guys are getting everything if you like the video please press the like button and subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends so let me know in the comment section how do you like the video so take some time to give your feedback so let's start number 11 Hassan has two fair spinners. Spinner A has three sections numbered 1, 2, 3. You see here 1, 2, 3. Spinner B has five sections 1, 2, 5. This side. Uh, find the probability of spinning. What? Spinning what? The same number on both spinners. The same number on both spinners. If you see that means this will be um how many are they in uh, the total outcomes total outcomes here total outcomes are so five this side and three this side so five times three that is 15 right so same number same number you will have here one one and then you will have two two then you will have three three so we have three outcomes out of 15 so 3 times 1 3 times 5 so 1 over 5 is will, will be the final answer for this um, number 2 a higher number on spinner B than on spinner A so now higher number on spinner B so if we write here higher number on spinner here is going to be let's see how it works so let's write down the sample space for that higher number of spin for spinner uh, this uh, B. Uh, so the outcomes that we are going to get, let me write down here. So outcomes that you are going to get, I'm writing spinner A first. 1, 1, uh, 1, 2, 1, 3, 1, 4, 1, 5. So the second one is spinner this is for spinner a and this is for spinner b so we have uh, number on spinner b more than uh, spinner a so let me first write down so second one is going to be 2 1 2 2 2 3 2 4 2 5 likewise 3 1 3 2 3 3 3 4 and 3, 5. So, these are the possible outcomes. So, number higher on spinner B than A. So, this one 1, 2, 3, 4, uh, then 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. The spinner has B has higher number. So, 9 out of 15. So, divide by 3, divide by 3. So, this is 3 over 5, right? So, 3 over 5. Five. Now, number uh, part B. Hassan also. So Hassan also has four other spinners C, D, E, and F. Each of these spinners has four sections. One, two, three, four. He spins each spinner a total of two hundred times and records the number of times he spins the number three. Um, so only one of these is a fair spinner. Uh, write e the letter of the spinner that is most likely to be fair so 200 so we have four spinners here so it should be around 50 so which value is nearest to 50 is 46 so our answer is going to be spinner d 
Question 12. The diagram shows a map with three villages A, B and C. So you see here is A, B and C. Measure the bearing of B from A. B from A, uh, that means uh, B from A. So you go to part A, you always go here from A. So north line is on A, A to B. This is line of B. So needs to measure, measure this angle. This angle is approximately equals to you put it here uh, I don't have let me check wait so here is the protractor you put it here on A and then you measure this is around 105 right? so 105 degrees so you need to measure this one 105 degrees right so work out the bearing of bearing of B from C so bearing of B from C so that means from C always go the point where it is written C from so from C is this we will go to C point up to B B is this line so you are going to look for this angle so now you see if you see this hole is 360 so 360 minus 97 so 360 minus 97 it's a 3 6 263 degrees right so that's it for this video remaining question we will do in the next part so i hope you guys understood everything i will wait for your comments guys please like share and subscribe see you in the next video god bless you guys